Hi guys, Joe here. Um, I recorded the Shazam reaction video, as you see by the title of the video, but the audio didn't sync up at first, or the audio didn't sync up the video. The Shazam video on CinemaSins, everything wrong with Shazam, that the audio on that was really, really low. The program or something, my headphones screwed up. Uh, but I fixed it. I had to use the audio, I had to screen record the video, use the audio, so I got that. Just wanted to let you know. So without further ado, here's the video. What is going on guys, Joe Hodge here back with another reaction, I'm going to do daily reactions before we get started, Brennan I wanted to let you know, special shout out that I am going to be doing the reaction to the Operation Norwoods wiki page that you sent me, uh, I just need another phone to read off of, uh, you use probably, my girlfriend's probably, but without further ado, as you can see by the title and the thumbnail, we are reacting to everything wrong with Shazam, I saw uh, Shazam and Love the movie. Absolutely love the movie. So let's get to it. This is made by CinemaSins, and here we go. Love this movie. Love it, love it, love it. The Warner Brothers logo, the dark and stormy night imagery, the sweeping score, the pan down to a snowy road. Are we sure this isn't a Harry Potter movie? You can't go crying to other people all the time. A man needs to This movie to was definitely much darker than uh, the trailers let on. Which must mean something, because in the theater, I swear I heard the sound of at least a dozen comic book boners launching simultaneously. I am the last of the Council of Wizards. Okay. God damn it, I wrote a whole sin about how Jaimon Hansu was double dipping in Marvel and DC, and that he was probably the only one who's yeah, done that been and realize like a both. million actors and actresses have done that. Halle Berry was Storm and Catwoman. So for making me think about yeah. Catwoman, somehow this movie gets a sit. He lies. Love the voices of those uh the we deadly sins, those power. Oh my gosh, it was awesome. When the Shazamily forefathers put this throne room together, who decided it was a good idea to design the apparently Just when you're sitting in a theater and you hear those voices and like it vibrates cool. in your ears and it sounds so powerful. I love that scene, that was great. He's a Shazam last minute much? If Thaddeus weren't so goddamn painfully slow at grabbing his balls, you'd be sh out of luck. Only the purest of hearts can resist their temptations. I mean, my girl is a classic, for sure. But why'd you have to go and bring Motown into this? You will never be worthy. Thanks, asshole. That's I mean, pretty harsh. Shazam brought Thaddeus here with no context, exposited a tiny bit, and now he insults him for... Yeah, I thought this was a really, 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 Shazam. really good movie. Like I said, much darker than what the trailers let on and um, Surprise, what everyone anticipated. Like, inside, it got really dark at, at times. By slow motion of the interior of the crash, Not too dark, though. Incongruously joyful music plays cliche. You're gonna be okay. <clears throat> you did this. Damn, this family is so committed to shaming this f***ing kid that the dickhead older brother would rather do that than look for help for his dying dickhead dad. <sighs> if the Sins have enough power to contact this kid in the real world this way, why wouldn't they have the power to spell it out a little more clearly to him? Or one of the many others who had the same experience. Or how I, I learned guess. to stop worrying and love Captain Marvel. Damn, the opening of this movie has more Philadelphia city porn than all the Rockies. All the I didn't have a problem with that. I mean, I know this channel is not to be taken seriously, super well, seriously. Crap, some some of the Sins he lists play it off as a nod by the director are, uh, of the previous film he made if you want but this serious in Aquaman but too. most of it is blame me in 2025 nitpicky stuff Disney envy results in Harry I didn't have a problem with all the, the Philadelphia the shots three Annabelle versus the Marthas open this up right now kid very good very funny man these are some tolerant ass cops Billy lured them into what could be a dangerous crime scene locked them in a pawn shop and commandeered their cruiser I know his motives are benign but the cops don't know that mom stalking also is this seriously the only way he can track down another Batson this is 2019 man everyone's findable you seriously don't think billy's mom has a instagram account <laughs> but i wanted a tiger yeah. oh but this is the real <clears throat> prize baby you can use that your whole life you'll always find your way movie steals the give a compass as a gift move from big and really a lot of from big right that's what happens when you suck direct video feed of me editing i thought the videos the kids in the foster the home every single one of them were the great feel how sharp okay this world obviously really exists did. in the dc universe since batman superman and wonder woman are all featured here but if that's the case then why set this in a real ass city like philly if gotham and metropolis exist where the hell are they located on the i-95 corridor thank you for this day thank you for this food Both the table meetings Even if it's not steak filet or Dude, we prayers or whatever dad. no need to show off with stretch rhyming a prayer also, I do have to take a sin off for Vincent and Rosa here, who are great models of actual foster parents that care. There were they so are, many yeah. depictions of awfulness. They were nice to watch. In movies. They were. This is a breath of fresh air. Wait, did I just get too serious? Um, scene does not contain a lap dance from Rosa. Roll credits for Prometheus School of Running Away from Things. Whew, that's better. He call himself a Weezer. 
<laughs> oh, he's like a wizard. A, a wizard from Harry Potter. Wait, wait, wait. Harry no. Potter also exists in the same universe as Superman and the other metahumans? Meaning that in this movie's world, J.K. Rowling said, You know what? There's not enough of a sense of mysticism and wonder around me. I think I'll invent a wizard and a magical school that people can read and escape to a new world instead of literally looking out their windows and seeing an alien flying around saving people. I'll even include broomsticks. Recurrent imagery has proven very common in cases of mass hysteria. I've heard about people seeing cats and dogs living together. I think I got it on video. Jesus, she's just mentioning this shit now after going through all this questioning? You can't believe any of this is real. That part's pretty dark Quick, when she like turns into some people can ash. Her, she turns into a disintegrating Indiana Jones Nazi. It doesn't. You know what it's like for a child to be told you'll never be good enough? Unfortunately, this is what Mark Strong's dialect coach should have told him about this American accent. Seems like that move would have been something to try on the mortal human as he was reaching for Satan's testicle a few seconds ago instead of Ooh. just yelling no. You are the true champion. I Jesus love the Christ. voices of the we Seven Deadly Sins. Like I said, oh my gosh, it was great. Really, really, also, really good. Sin ball. That's a ball of sins, man. How do I not have a replica of this on my kitchen table? Through you, they'll spread the poison to everything they touch. Make mankind turn on each other. Twitter. They asked people the same question. You know, yeah. what, what power do you want? But this time, they made it so the answers were anonymous. The fact that this character is fully fleshed out and physically disabled, but the movie doesn't make a big deal about it, is something that should be celebrated like hell. Don't mm -hmm. touch my brother. What do you need your fake? Freddy did really good that. Yeah. Yeah, actor that played Freddy did really good. Bully so hard, they belong in a Stephen King novel. This movie yeah, is yeah. hilarious. Dude, up with the over-the-top dickwads in this movie. I thought Thaddeus' family was bad. But these motherfuckers are so into assholery that they've abandoned their truck in the school parking lot just to track Billy down to the fucking subway. Are people extra dickish in Philadelphia? Wait, I think I just answered my own question. Hello? Man, Philly's public transit system is tough as balls. The lights stay on and <laughs> okay. all traveling to a secret magical dimension. <laughs> New York City and Chicago can barely keep theirs on under the best of circumstances. Long ago, we chose a champion, and we chose recklessly. Spark's position. He used his power for revenge, releasing the seven deadly sins into your world. That's a real shame and all, but when did this happen? Were people not sinning at all to that point? Or just not deadly sinning? I'm sinning the fact that these sinners weren't previously sinning. That's enough. a lot of sins. Millions of lives were lost. Well, I'm sure wrath and envy were pretty rough to deal with, but did lust and pride really take a f ton of people out? And if so... Shouldn't they're they're slow. Bad. They're really <laughs> slow when they're in monster Sam. form. Rolls and it's the wisdom of Solomon, the strength of Hercules. Blah blah Love that scene. for Atlas, blah blah Z for Zeus. Get it? It's an acronym. Many people don't know this, but Jeremy is also an acronym for all my powers. The good looks of Jim Neighbors, the discernment of Eric Stoltz, the integrity of Richard Nixon, oh, the height of Elijah Wood, the universal appeal of Michael Moore, and the gravitas of Yahoo Sirius. Jealous? Character gives brief message about great power along with a couple guidelines that immediately croaks cliche. Come on, man, this is public goddamn transit. A dude in a superhero costume wouldn't call I hear that a lot, battle. that in public transit it's like so New York and enough, Philadelphia. Very People don't really care. Happened. Like that's a norm Damn is it. to see things like that. I guess. The screaming. Wouldn't you just gently raise the sign into Freddy's sight? <laughs> Invisible! Invisible! This movie Seriously, was great. Exactly. This movie Levi was really good. Casting really good. Human to play a superhero in a red outfit since Ryan Reynolds got his second shot at Deadpool. Within the first few minutes of trying to figure out his superpower, Shazam encounters a mugging and an armed robbery. Either Philadelphia's got a Gotham-level crime problem, or this movie has a DCEU-level yeah. convenience problem. Or maybe both. You have bullet immunity! <laughs> Freddy's yeah, phrasing for things is hilarious. Kind of bullet immunity... Right in the yeah, actually, that's about it. That's the only like the odd thing he says. Okay. Really trying to figure out his powers was fun. Early. In terms of phrasing things, just dump from the risks they immediately take to the number of bullets the thugs have to the complicity of these assholes being willing to commit murder in the service of knocking off one convenience store. It's so dumb for a pretty smart movie. Since he wrapped them in Christmas lights and the trapping of the season all around, with. I look forward to the Ishizama Christmas movie arguments for years to come. I genuinely can't think of a better way to spend our time. I totally get why Rocky was training so hard to get up here. Jesus, <laughs> this movie has more winking pop culture references than. An episode of Cinema Sins. Also, it's pretty impressive that they're able to have this conversation all alone at the top of a huge tourist attraction with a big ass Christmas tree on it. Is it really that late at night? Yeah, uh, yeah I saw a clip of this yesterday. Yeah, there would be a lot of people up there the with all that, especially since it's Philadelphia. Whispering in the room, the sound of Shazam turning back into Billy, and the fact that a missing child just returned to her house. Savannah Industries must have a PR person on staff that would advise against their logo <laughs> looking like a swastika, right? Oh, brother. Thank God Thad identified his brother by name, or I'd have completely lost the context of this relationship. Also, this is why I'll never be a board member for a big, probably corrupt organization. Chances of you being attacked by a sin demon increased by 800%. It's mad, oh, yeah. man. 
Hey kids, want to go see the super fun movie where a kid gets superpowers and also nightmare creatures eat the heads off people? Don't worry, we won't show you any Even with the so small budget Shazam, the Shazam had, Listen, the I still thought the CGI was really, best. really good. I loved it, but that devastated me. This is power more than anyone has. There is one more powerful. Guys, I'm in the middle of my big you dad speech here. Can the magic mirror exposition wait a few minutes? Man, just punch the button. Oh my god. God, the truck! Replace the truck with a dumpster, and this is exactly the character arc of the bullies from the never-ending story. Oh, and every other school bully arc ever in the history of film. I don't think that's gonna buff out. Not that yeah. I'm rooting for anything to happen to Freddy, but these two dick had massive bully boners yesterday, and now Freddy gets this close to him, insults them, and they do nothing? I'm so sorry yeah, I'm late. I got heaven. held up at the business office. Doing all the work stuff. <laughs> Why the hell did it take DC this f***ing long to make a funny movie? Damn it, I really want to remove a sin here, but it took so long for DC to make a funny movie. And the Lego Batman movie is a whole different thing, so that doesn't count. Luckily for this training montage, there's no shortage of abandoned warehouses in the greater Philadelphia area. Har 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 movie. Seriously, Freddy's actively trying to kill Billy. You too. Yeah. Also, Zapped like, what if, in America movie. What Seriously. If say something could, could hurt him. Appropriation from the Avengers for Billy. Thor is sitting right there. Your phone charged. Your phone charged. Just yesterday, Everyone was gawking at Shazam, and he wasn't even doing anything. Now he's walking around the f mall, shooting electricity from his fingers, and barely gets a second glance. The sin here is that it took this f long for Billy to think oh my to gosh. Go to the booty trap. I love how they, I love why they I love that they put that in there. You got to remember, he's still a kid, exactly how old they are. not an adult, in an adult body. I use my magical superpowers to steal from a f***ing bank years old. Wait, is this supposed to be the same day as they left school? So they went all the way to the warehouse, did the entire training montage, uploaded all those videos to YouTube, jumped into the building, traveled to the mall to hang out for a while, went to the titty twister, robbed the ATM, then bought all this sh and installed it all before they even head to the real estate office? I'm not saying it's impossible, but it sure as hell is a Ferris Bueller level of improbable. All hands on deck. Man, they sure did yada yada Billy's return, didn't they? And have they seriously not noticed the brand new electronic gone girl shed full of <laughs> he's got in his room? Costume stupid. Big white cape like he's getting married or something. Wait, what? Are wedding capes a thing? I love that kid's because acting. He's like nervous and anxious. Like and I could've worn a cape. everything he says is calculated and one cool sidekick. Like, um, Louis he kind of fears for his life saying the wrong thing. How do you know my name? The better question is why isn't Mary in school right now? In the middle of the day. That's like And I love the suit too. A lot of people saying that um, the muscles look really fake. And I wouldn't say they look 100% real. But the more I watch the movie, the more I'm like, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm sold on it. I know there's a happy ending, but there's also a ton of dickishness from a lot of the main characters to get through beforehand. Look, it doesn't matter if it hit the ground or he caught it. The deceleration rate is pretty much the same, especially as it shows. Yeah, that would hurt a lot of people. Unless one of his powers is reversing the walls of inertia, these people are as dead as they would be if they hit the ground. Also, he apparently caught it on the glass. So how did it not immediately shatter at that speed and force? You have to move. Yeah. Move. Move. Shoot. Shoot. Please be a good dog. Come on, man. You got the entire open street to your right to put that down. So it seems Philadelphia has gotten an early Christmas present in the form of its very own superhero. Why isn't this a big deal? Like when Batman and Superman were running around their towns, they were surrounded by the press. But Shazam saves a city bus and they only send one f***ing reporter? A floating! <laughs> oh, of course the truck comes by and hits him because ha ha comedy but seriously this trucker didn't think to break at all for the person floating in the middle of the road for several seconds i'm really starting to suspect the driving in philadelphia oh good i get to watch the last 20 minutes of man of steel again what is discount hey i love that movie from all this and He's batman around the city man. Punching, I love those movies. Shazam, and as soon as he lands a shot he just hangs out intimidatingly how's that gonna get the power transferred to him these shopping bags are such obvious cg and i totally noticed this and figured that out on my own Billy, come on. i didn't holy Nozzle, this instant discovery of Billy's identity is the most convenient set of conveniences to ever convenience. Super villain! Super villain! Worse, much worse. Really? <laughs> I mean, I get that you got that whole demon LASIK thing going on, but what makes your evil any worse than Zod or Eclipso or Kite Man? Whoa. Ooh, Kite Man. Yeah. I swear people in movies watch the local news at a rate of 25,000% more than people in the real world. What's Freddy doing with a superhero? A better question would be, why is the network constantly airing footage of Freddy and Billy arguing instead of images from the bus saving or the interview itself? These kids just saunter into the house with coats on. Uh, I guess there's no such thing as a coat rack in this house. Although, Darla's so slow here that she's that shouldn't be a sin. That's way too nitpicky. I walk in with like a lot of time. superpower turns out to be speed, which is such a cool, cool. movie thing that I must give credit where it's due. It's hot out right now. Billy? Whoa, did the all-powerful evil wizard seriously just ring the f***ing doorbell? Actually, I take that back. What a toll. Obvious presidential slam is appreciated. I mean, obvious. I let go, but it was by accident. That's a sad I thing when he, when he, uh... What? 
Jesus Talks Christ, this real mom. story is worse than all the times Bruce Wayne's parents were killed combined. Setting aside how creepily young Marilyn was when she had Billy, she's describing her abandonment of him in the middle of a public place in the freezing goddamn cold. And Billy still turned out to be somewhat affable. So this sin is for Bruce ending up as such a whiny bitch. Billy! Billy! Oh, come on. The first time we saw this, the compass had been kicked around a few feet, maybe enough to get him truly lost in the crowd. But he was definitely within earshot of these calls by his name. Come home, Billy. Come home. Thad supervillain yeah, but, the you know, kids repeater. think, young, young kids think, like, one-dimensional, like, I need to Land do this. Lines. Say your name. And while you're at it, name the living members of the Rolling Stones, just in case it helps with the match. <laughs> Sequels. How did Thad know exactly where the kids went? Was he also imagining a strip club and just happened to pick the same one? I guess it's not Maybe. that crazy of an assumption, considering the booty trap does have those free hot wings. We separate the sins from the eye, and he's just an old man. Hey, yeah, I get told something like that multiple times per day. Gather the mutts. That's racist. Full body mouth vagina. Vagina. <laughs> Ew. Oh, yeah. You can go full smoke monster to avoid contact. Since they have that power, I'm sure the movie will remain consistent, and no one will ever land a punch or kick on one of them for the rest of the film. Wait a minute, he clearly screams Shazam here. I mean, I know he's underwater and all, but is the movie saying the phrase has to be clearly audible? I think so. As funny as it sounds, it, it does have to be audible. Thing? Is there some sort of Shazam referee? It's, it's, it's muffled. Mm, Can he just use know. one of his challenges and send it to the replay booth? Who decides what constitutes a Shazam? I guess the statue's been... Takes off sunglasses. Penalized. Man, this movie oh contains a surprisingly high amount of defiant and resolute staring. Are you making some of my big e evil guy speech right now or something? You're like a mile away from me. Hilarious moment, honestly. But if Thad is doing this cliche monologuing, why isn't he any closer? <laughs> Still better than the actual movie. The exact hey, it's a good movie. As the execs at Warner Brothers after seeing the public's response to this movie. Look, the end of this movie is really fun, but it's also equal parts X-Men, Harry Potter, Mighty Morphin Power Rangers, and Infinity War. So it takes a little bit of the wind out of the sails. I'm not mad. I'm just noticing a derivative when I see it. This hell spawn really wants to murder the f out of this Ferris wheel, man. What the hell did it ever do to him? That he doesn't like Ferris wheels. Like right wheels. here, like he's Henry and Cavill, which is hilarious when juxtaposed with what happened with him in Justice League and Mission Impossible fallout. How the shit did everyone determine that it was okay to come back to the carnival? Sure, that looks like he's defeated, but there's still a glowing ball of literal fucking sin potentially in play. I invited another friend, I hope Yes, that's the okay. Superman. Awesome. I bet he's doing uh, this instead of saving some village in Mexico or Russia or something. Cameo, but that can make it a word. Man, DC's reboot of Jiminy Cricket is gritty as hell. Yeah, that was a good movie. I, I love Shazam. Really good movie. He's saying, wow, every time you use this towel. And that's Darla. And Darla. <laughs> Darla! And they're certainly not showing Willy Wonka. any signs that they are slowing. Hello? Okay, well, if you enjoyed this reaction, hit the like button, subscribe, comment. I will see you guys in the next video. Uh, Brennan, I'm going to get to that video real soon about the... Uh, I didn't expect that. I, I don't I'm gonna be getting into that video of the uh, Operation Northwoods, uh, Nor Norwoods, very soon. The wiki page that you want me to do. So uh, I will see you guys in the next video, and yeah. Whatever, kid. I do what I want. Puny god.